hey did you miss me i'm back today with another plt haul my first one since having bambino let's get right into it <laughs> This is the first piece of outfit that I wanted to show you. So it's basically giving us this satin long line shirt just here, which I've actually decided to just bring out around the fight area because these shorts are short. Okay, they are extremely short, extremely, extremely short. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, it's really short. So I don't know if, like, me putting the shirt out here is, like, giving extra material. I don't know. But um, I decided to do something. I thought, let me just do something, something with it. So this is the shirt just here. And I teamed up with these shorts. I cannot remember where I got these shorts from. Um, I really don't know. But it's like hoochie mama shorts. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know where I'm actually going with these shorts. I don't know what I'm thinking. But I thought, why not pair it up with this shirt, you know? But I thought, why not, why not, why not? So I paired up like this. And to be honest with you, these shorts are so tight on me now since having the baby. I'm not going to lie. The last time I wore these shorts, I can't even remember when. But I was clearly much slimmer. Because now, honey, it is cutting off my blood circulation. Okay, it's so tight around my thighs. Like, it's unbelievable. I don't think I'll actually wear this out in public. Like, do you know what I'm saying? I don't think I will because I feel just a little bit uncomfortable that's the honest truth because it's super tight like i said around my thighs it's just yeah it's just really really uncomfortable i'm gonna have to constantly be pulling it down but i did think this look together is really cute and the shirt itself is like cuffed it's got like this long cuffed details just here which i really really love it's all about the details it just gives extra detailing to your outfit and i'm 100 percent here for it it's got three buttons just there on the side. I really do love this shirt. It feels absolutely gorgeous. And it's in this white, gorgeous uh, satin just here. And of course, it's given us collared details as well. Uh, just because I'm not sure of what size I am since I'm with a baby, I did decide to go a size up. I could have easily just got my normal size because I was worried that it would be tight around the arms. Because um, I feel like it is a tad too big like do you know what I mean there's just too much like material being left I'm not really here for that at all I know I've put on weight but you know we still want to wear clothes that somewhat fit um so yeah I'm not really feeling it at all I did go a size up so maybe I might um reorder it in a size down we'll see uh but i am really like really really do like it and this is it pulled down or pulled out this is what it looks like pulled out so you can see it's quite long line i mean some people will actually wear this as a shirt dress and and still make it look really cute so it looks like this and like i mentioned i did go a size up and it's given us like a long line detail just here it is longer at the back so yeah so this is what we're working with let me show you what it looks like with like a blazer on top because that will make a good outfit as well you know for the more classier girls you know if you wanted to just put like a blazer over it then you could and it'll be giving you something like this which i also think is really cute as well especially if you're going out for like the late evening date nights or whatever you're going out for a few drinks with the girls you may decide like okay actually i do want to wear with your mama shorts but I do want to be a little bit more modest, then you can just leave the shirt looking like this. Or you can tuck in one side like that and leave out the other side. I think this is a cute look as well. So we'll be giving a little something like this. I might pair it up with this brown bag also from Pretty Little Thing. And the shoes are also from Pretty Little Thing as well. And we get this look here. Okay, so the white shirt I picked up in a size eight, I could have went a size down. The blazer is old from Zara and the shirt has a zero stretch. It is not stretchy at all. So by the way, oh my gosh, these jeans are pre-pregnancy and you can tell these jeans are tight, 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 tight. 
Let me tell you how you can tell these jeans are tight. Number one, okay? Okay, number one, why are the pockets hanging out? Why is the pocket hanging out? Number two, the zip is not even in the center. I don't know if you guys can see it, but the zip is not in the center. It's leaning, it's leaning this way. Can you see that? It's just like yeah, leaning over here because for some reason, I just can't seem to get it in the middle. Like I have to do like this electric shake here. Oh my God. All right, it's a little bit in the middle, but oh my gosh. The way I'm sweating. I don't know if this is just like, because I gave birth, I feel like the hormones are still working in my system. I don't know, but this is a lot of work. I forgot how much work actually goes into this. Anyways, let's talk about the boots. Ah, I can't even bend over. This is a lot. <laughs> All right, I am in love with these boots. These boots are absolutely gorgeous. Let me tell you about these boots for a second. So it folds over and at the bottom, the boots look like this, like underneath. Ooh. Underneath the boots look like this, right? Very plain, very simple. You know, it is what it is. There's actually a zip just here on the inside of the boots but I think what gives it that extra je ne sais quoi oui je m'appelle is just the way that it folds over it just has this really gorgeous sort of like vintage look I don't know I don't know but I think it's absolutely gorgeous 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 and I'm so here for it I feel like these boots pair up with any outfit it's literally going to elevate your outfit and take your outfit to the next level mama This is how I would wear this outfit and I think this outfit is so stunning. And in terms of stretchability, I will probably give, give these jeans a zero out of three. There is no stretch at all, at all, at all. But this is how I paired up this outfit together and I think it's absolutely stunning, stunning, stunning. This jeans I got in a size 14. Um, and I said this was pre-pregnancy, so I'm a little bit surprised that I can fit in it still, but although it is very, very tight, it's given this. And I got the blazer from Zara. This was from last year, but any white blazer will absolutely do with this outfit. If you want mamas, be extra and throw in a little bit of color. And I decided to pair it up with this bag also from Pretty Little Thing. The details on this bag is absolutely stunning, stunning, stunning. So gorgeous. And the bodysuit is also from Pretty Little Thing. I'm going to find one that is similar um, so I can put up for you, but any white bodysuit will absolutely do. This is given like, you know, date night. I'm going out with the girls from brunch. Like, listen, white always works. White is absolutely gorgeous. And in this warmer weather, summer, white is definitely one that you can always count on. 100%. I'm gonna go ahead and take this outfit off because the sweat on my face is evident that I am struggling. These shorts are tight. Oh no, no, I forgot to mention. These shorts are actually shorts that I decided to rip. <laughs> They're actually shorts, they look like this. Yes, this is what it originally looks like, but I decided to cut off the bottom because let me show you why I bought these jeans here and the jeans don't fit. Like I struggled, struggled, struggled. I'm gonna show you the jeans, yeah, hang on. So actually, these are the jeans that I originally purchased to wear with this outfit. Not this particular outfit, but with another outfit that I had in mind, but it just did not fit at all. And this one I got in a size 12, and it just wouldn't even go past my thighs at all. So I am going to put the details, obviously, in the description box for those that are interested in purchasing this one because the one that I'm wearing, I literally ripped up old jeans that I had. It was a bit damaged around the leg area. So I was just like, let me just chop it up and you know make something else out of it. So I've done that because honey child, I do not know what size I am. I don't know. I've got jeans that are size 12, 
which some fit like this one is somewhat fits and then i've got like a size 14 jeans that fits well and i've also got a size 16 jeans that fit well as well so i don't know i'm all over the place i know i know i know what you guys are going to say give your body time give your body time and trust me i am giving my body time i am not even in a rush or whatever but i'm just speaking really openly with you guys because that's just how i feel sometimes i'm like oh my god i'm so fat ah! Then some days I'm like, I'm a bad mama, I'm a bad mama. But you know, there's good days and bad days. Anyway, let's move on to the next outfit. This one, this one, this one. Um, the vision I had in my head was like top notch. The vision in my head was like, okay. But when I'm putting it on, I'm like, okay. Like this one, I don't know about this one. I don't know why I got it in a size. I've got this one in a size 12. Okay, so I've got this one in a size 12. Cause I thought that the size 10 would be way too small, but I think I should have got a size 10 because the material is super stretchy on this one. I mean, look at that, right? Super stretchy, like I definitely, I definitely should have got a size 10. So then it would have given me like, like this, you know, it would have given me a more of a snatched figure type of thing, which would have been really cute and really gorgeous because it's given us like this bit over here, I don't know what to call it. It's given us this little section here, which I thought was really, really cute, but it's just so massive, it's huge. But I thought this would have looked cute, you know, just like that. But of course it's massive, 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 massive. I should have just read a bit more and um, I would have seen that it was the stretchy material. I don't know if they included that in there, like, but this is definitely, definitely, definitely stretchy, stretchy, stretchy. Out of three, I would probably give this one a three. Yeah, three out of three when it comes to stretch because, I mean, look at all this space here. There's a huge amount of space. And this one, absolutely gorgeous. I'm wearing it with the bodysuit that I had on from earlier. And yeah, I mean, it's given vibes. If it was fitting, it would have definitely given vibes, you know? A little classy or whatever. But yeah. Okay, next I got this gorgeous, gorgeous brown dress just here. This is a definitely one of my favorites in this haul, honey, because it's giving me sexy, but it's also giving me comfort as well. You know what I'm saying? I really love this color. I just love the fact that it's like a free flow type of dress, like so it's not hugging me too tight around like the belly because like I said, this is a postpartum haul, okay? So some of y'all may be like, snap back, snap back, snap back. But I just know that my body isn't really back to, well, it will never really go back to its natural state anyways. But you know, there's still bits and bobs that I want to work on. Like there's a few cellulites in the clappers area and stuff like that, which I don't always want to share. I don't really want to expose right now. So I really feel like this is just giving me a little bit of comfort under this dress. You know what I'm saying? It is providing me with a little bit of comfort, which I'm absolutely here for. It goes down basically to probably my ankles. It's like ankle length and I'm really here for it. It is not stretchy at all. Um, but like I said, because it's kind of giving us like the flare where it just kind of like, kind of spreads out here at the bottom. I don't really think you need to worry really much about the stretchy component of the dress. Um, and here, just here at the top here, it has like gathered details just here, which I really love, I'm really here for. And what I would actually do is with wearing this one, I would put like padded, um, like the, the breast pads, I'll just slide them in there, just slide them in there, you know, just in case of any leakages or whatever. That's what I did the last time I wore this dress. And I'm just absolutely here for it. I just love the way that it gives me all of this up here. And it looks like this on the back area, just like that. And this would have looked so gorgeous, you know, whilst I was pregnant. If I wore this with my pregnant belly, oh my God, I would have looked so cute. Like, can you just imagine this dress with like a bump? Oh my God. Like, 
by the way like i don't know about you guys but i definitely miss my bump i really really miss my bump it just it's almost like a grieving process that no one really prepared me for i swear to you guys i'm not exaggerating i just feel like the bump is gone and like what do i do with myself now what do i do with my belly like do i like obviously i can't rub it but i just miss that whole rubbing i just miss being like vulnerable and having the belly no one warned you about that i weren't warned i definitely weren't warned about it but i definitely do miss my belly on that note i will not be getting pregnant again so nobody be like have another one or don't have it that's it no babies no babies no for me but i definitely do miss my belly um just being there but yeah this would have looked super super cute if i still had my bump so yeah this is what it's looking like when i tell you i had to constantly go back to the picture <laughs> to figure out how to put this one on oh some of these outfits honestly need to come with instructions because wow that was a lot so i wanted to show you guys this top which i thought was really really cute is it blurry or is it okay i wanted to show you guys this top which i thought was really 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 cute i mean i'm definitely here for the details on this one it's giving details and details on details on it it's giving us this cross crisscross halter neck situation happening here and then it's giving us like a little cutout just here on the shoulders which i think is super super cute and it's giving us also just here a little corset detail like that as well i've put them on with these jeans i believe these jeans are from primark um but i'm definitely here for this top and it's giving us like a mesh detail just here um on the back area as you can see and i think it's absolutely stunning although it's a little bit tight like around the wrist um area so do bear that in mind it is really 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 tight like super tight it, like there's no need like what is the reason we could have done without it we could have done without it and it's also mesh just there on the arms as well and it's given us just here a little corset detail that goes up like that that just helps to push up your mm -hmm. i'm absolutely here for it and it's quite easy to put on once you know what it looks like or what it's supposed to look like on it's quite easy to put on but i did struggle with it just a little bit at the beginning uh but yeah i'm absolutely here for this one i like 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 this one and you know what white goes perfect with jeans like blue jeans and a white top it's just a match made in heaven so absolutely so i also picked up this very cute 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 corset here which i thought just looked absolutely stunning i love the color and i also love the sweetheart cut just there absolutely here for it i feel like corsets are definitely my thing now i'm definitely into it it's definitely a bit on me um so when i saw this one i was like yes please yes please however i do feel like i could have got a size smaller and i love the fact that it's sort of giving me like a heart shape just here at the front i'm definitely here for it for it and because it comes out just here at the bottom it can hide the postpartum belly just a little bit there um so i'm 100% here for this i think it looks absolutely cute there's no stretch to this at all and this is what the back of it looks like it looks like this um on the back just there and it's got a back zip just here um i would say there's no stretch to this at all like zero out of three when it comes to stretch there's no stretch at all but i did get this one in a size 12 and i feel like it's okay and it's giving me plenty of room like around the front just here just in case you know my breasts do become a little bit full whilst i'm out or whatever it's not gonna put too much pressure do you know what i mean it's not really gonna be too tight around the front bit just here so it is giving me a little bit of space just here um a little bit of room so that when the breast does enlarge it it's not gonna be painful or anything like that um yeah and i absolutely love it and it's also giving us like the little uh silicone bits just around here as well so that it doesn't drop down because you know sometimes you wear corsets and it hasn't got the little plastic thing around it and it just slips down and you spend half of the night pulling up pulling up pulling up i doubt you're gonna get this problem with this corset because it has got the plastic all around it so it's gonna give you a bit of security just there and yeah so this is what it looks like guys 
You're making too much noise. Okay, next up I've got these stone wash trousers just here, which I love. However, I do wish it was just a little bit more tighter, especially just the front around the front here. I feel like it's given too much baggy, too much loose. But I'm not 100% mad. Like in certain poses, it looks fine. It's only when I like face front, it's kind of giving like doo doo, but around the front bit. Do you know what I mean? It's just giving a bit too much loose, like a bit too loose, a bit too loose. But I'm definitely here for this one. Okay, and this one is not stretchy at all. And I've just teamed it up with this um, shirt here that I've got um, like two, two months ago maybe um, from Primark. This one I've got in a size 12, this shirt. When I told you my arms are so tight, like if I squeeze any harder, the shirt will literally rip open. So maybe if you're thinking about getting this shirt, maybe go and size up, or maybe not. Maybe it's just my arms. Maybe I've just got Hercules arms. Don't know, but my arms are a little bit too tight in this one. Um, and I, like I said, I picked it up in a size 12. But these trousers are really, really nice as well. I really love as well. And it's also given us belt details just here. So you can hold it up and it is high-waisted which we love on this channel yes we love high-waisted and now even more so than before i'm definitely here for high-waisted 100 percent. these kids are making too much joy okay so i also picked up this cute orange 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 this cute orange clutch bag just here. I'm definitely here for the details on this one. Let me just pull up closer so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Oh my. Look at the details on this bag. I'm 100% here for this one. Absolutely stunning. Absolutely gorgeous. And allowed me to open the bag just like this. And it's given us a zip detail just in here and it is really spacious as well just like that i'm absolutely here for the detail sunny you know of course we're doing like color blocking and stuff of that nature but um mixing textures together is also in as well so don't be afraid to not only color block but to also add texture to your outfit i think it just adds a little vava form to your outfit so i've got this bag here which i'm going to be putting details up as well and i also picked up these earrings here which i am going to put up a closer picture for you so that you can actually see um with this one it has got a little bit of weight to it i must admit i don't really like to wear like hoops or earrings or anything like that that has so much weight because i don't want it to like stretch out my um my ears um, it has, it is a little bit weighty, like towards the end of the night when I wore it last, towards the end of the night, it did feel like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I need to take these off. Um, but that's just me, maybe I'm just like sensitive to um, hoop earrings that have a little bit of weight, I'm not sure. But yeah, I mean, I did think it was really cute and it looks really nice on as well. Okay, so I've got these two outfits here, these two jeans here that just did not fit and it's not too much surprise because i've got one in a size 12 and i've got one in a size 14 and both of these jeans did not fit at all and it's almost like i knew you know i'm really after like high waisted tall straight leg jeans and these are it but unfortunately it just didn't fit i am going to insert like a picture just here on the side so that you guys can have a look at to see what it would have looked like. Um, unfortunately for me, it just didn't really do much at all. Talking of jeans that didn't fit, I'm gonna show you guys, I've actually got a pile of jeans that I'm gonna put up on my Depop. None of these jeans fit. Let me show you guys actually, because it's actually ridiculous. These are all of my jeans that I used to wear before getting pregnant, and none of these jeans fit. It's actually ridiculous. And it's like really good jeans as well. And I'm just like, what shall I do? What shall I do? I know a few people have been like saying I should wait. I'm going to lose the weight. And at the same time, I'm just thinking, oh my God, I just want to free up space. I want to free up space. And 
I don't know, I really don't know what to do. I'm so, so, so confused. Like these jeans are new with like tags on and it just doesn't fit me. Let me try these ones on quickly. I know I've had, got look, like there's no point. There's no point of actually going any further because already the five bits are saying no. And these jeans are like flared. Look, they're like flared jeans. Oh. <gasps> Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Like it's like really flared and stuff, but it's definitely not gonna fit me at all. I've tried them on before already. These jeans don't don't fit. These jeans don't fit, and I've got a few others here as well that just don't fit me, and it's just jarring. I think what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna put them on my Depop. So guys, do follow me over on my Depop in case you see any of these outfits on there i'm gonna put up loads of jeans so you know you might be able to grab some for like five pounds two pounds whatever you know but i'm definitely gonna put them up i want to free up some space because we are going into like the autumn winter season soon anyway so um i'm gonna free up some space and you know now that i'm back doing my hauls again and stuff like that um I want to like change my wardrobe. I want to change stuff around. I feel like since having the baby, like my style has changed a little bit. Um, so I'm definitely going to try and get rid of a lot of these um, outfits. So do follow me over on my Depop. Follow me on my Instagram, honey. I'm so sorry if this haul was like all over the place. Like I said, it's my first one back since having the baby. So I'm still sort of like trying to get back into the rhythm of things. But if you enjoyed this haul, give me a massive, massive, massive big thumbs up. Share it to a sis or a bro and tell them that your girl is back small small but i'm trying tell them that your girl is back and yeah comment down below let me know which of the outfits were your favorite i'm gonna put all of the details in the description box down below guys excuse me if this was like <laughs> i'm so sorry i'm so sorry i promise you on the next one i'm gonna be more on point i'm hot i'm sweating i'm t i'm dehydrated ciao There's a lot going on. But thank you guys so much for watching. Love you guys and I appreciate you guys so much. And I'll catch you guys on another video. Mwah. Bye. Shut the door, please.